Boeing PA Poseidon Hello and welcome to another exciting video from War Secrets. With tensions rising between China and US and its allies in the South China Sea and Greater Pacific region, the need for naval supremacy has never been greater for these two adversaries. And a component of the American arsenal to dominate the region is the P-8 Poseidon. So stick to the video till the end to know the complete details about this beast of a naval aircraft. Now, let's begin. Design the plane's design is based on a 737-800's fuselage and a 737-900's wings. In comparison to the 737-800, the P-8 has a higher gross weight capability. The P-8's wingtips were altered from a blended wing. The internal weapon storage is located beneath the fuselage front portion. Hard points for carrying air-to-surface missiles are integrated into the 737-900 style wings. Cockpit and Flight Management Systems Smith's Aerospace created flight management system and a store management systems for the P-8. The Smith's Aerospace Flight Management System is built on an open, integrated design that will allow future upgrade systems to be integrated. Up to seven operator consoles are available in the cabin. L3 Communications WeScam was chosen by Boeing to provide the MX-20 HD digital electro-optical and infrared multispectral sensor turrets for the P-8 Poseidon. The infrared CCD TV, image intensifier, laser rangefinder, and laser illuminator sensors in the MX-20 HD are all gyro-stabilized. Raytheon's improved APS 137D5 maritime surveillance radar and signal intelligence SIGINT equipment are also installed aboard the aircraft. On the expanded nose fairing, the AN APY 10 radar is fitted, which has a synthetic aperture radar mode for imaging, detection, classification, and identification of stationary ships and small vessels, as well as high resolution imaging synthetic aperture radar mode for imaging, detection, classification, and tracking of surface submarines and small fast moving vessels operating in coastal waters. The SAR enables high-resolution target identification, combat damage assessment, and weapon targeting by providing a multiple-resolution strip map and spot SAR operation. High scan speeds, high pulse repetition frequency, and high-resolution mode with enhanced sea clutter rejection are used in periscope detection. The new global positioning system includes anti-jam, integrated friend or foe, and towed decoy salt protection suites as well as a broadcast information system and secure UHF satellite communications, according to Raytheon. The CAE Advanced Integrated Magnetic Anomaly Detection System is installed on the P-8A. The aircraft is equipped with an EDO Corporation developer rotary Sonoboy launcher with pneumatic ejection. The Northrop Grumman Information Technology Division in Hendon, Virginia is working on the data connections. Weapons in the combined bomb bay, freefall bombs, Raytheon Mark 54 torpedoes, and depth charges may all be carried at the same time. Air to surface missiles are installed in hard points on the underside of the wings. The P-8A was armed with a high altitude variant of the MK-54 torpedo, which was designed by the United States Navy for the use in combat. It was also successfully tested in October 2011 by the P-8A Poseidon, which boosted the number of armament systems that could be used aboard the aircraft carrier. Countermeasures When it comes to countermeasures, the P-8 Poseidon is outfitted with a Terma an alq 213 Electronic Warfare Management System, a Northrop Grumman Directional Infrared Countermeasure Set, a Northrop Grumman Radar Warning System, and a BAE System Countermeasures Dispenser System, to name a few components. Northrop Grumman is the company that provides all of these electronic warfare sub-protection packages. Aircraft Performance and Engines The aircraft can cruise at about 926 km per hour at a high altitude and hover at 60 meters over the sea at 333 km per hour. The aircraft is powered by two 120 kilonaut CFM International CFM 56-7B27A high bypass turbofan engines. The Boeing 737 Airborne Early Warning and Control Aircraft in development for Australia and Turkey, as well as the U.S. Navy C-40 Clipper Transport, are powered by the same CFM 56-7 engines. The engine has recorded more than 30 million flight hours 
and a confirmed high reliability figure of merit at 0.003% in flight shutdown rate per 1,000 flight hours. Additional fuel tanks have been placed in the rear luggage hold, giving the aircraft a total fuel capacity of 34,096 kilograms. Combat Role of the P-8 Poseidon The P-8A is capable of carrying out anti-submarine warfare, anti-surface warfare, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as humanitarian assistance missions. Secure, interoperable, and network-ready system contribute to the enhancement of these capabilities. In addition to high-quality armament systems, the aircraft is designed with an open architecture that allows for future extensions and modification. Background Boeing created a 737 BBJ-2 technology demonstration plane to show off the plane's capabilities and onboard equipment. The aircraft was equipped with two operational mission system consoles. The plane finished a tour of U.S. Navy facilities and naval air stations at Brunswick, Maine, Jacksonville, Florida, Norfolk, Virginia, Kaneohe, Hawaii, and Whidbey Island, Washington in December 2003. Maximum power takeoff and climb to 41,000 feet, manual reversion maneuvers without hydraulics, maximum rate of descent of more than 10,000 feet per minute, tactical maneuvers at 200 feet, simulated single-engine maneuvers, and performance landing with a stopping distance of less than 610 meters were among the demonstrations. The Boeing 737 MMA was chosen in July 2004. The contract was awarded for the production of five experimental aircraft over the following eight years. One plane was set aside for airworthiness, static, and fatigue tests, while the two planes were set aside for mission system testing. In November 2005, the preliminary design review was successfully completed. In July 2007, the critical design assessment was completed. In December 2007, Boeing began manufacturing the first of five test planes. In April 2009, the P-8A test aircraft T-1 completed its maiden flight. The T-2's first mission systems test flight was performed successfully in June 2010. In July 2010, the T-3 test aircraft conducted its maiden flying test. In January 2011, full-scale static testing on the airframe of the first ground test vehicle as one was completed. As to the second ground test vehicle, began fatigue testing in late 2011. In July 2011, the first P-8A production plane flew for the first time. Users The Australian government received first pass authorization to join in a cooperative development of the P-8A Poseidon in July 2007. The P-8A would replace the AP-3C Orion aircraft in the RAAF's fleet. In March 2012, a memorandum of understanding for the aircraft's manufacturing and development was signed. India ordered eight P-8I long-range maritime surveillance and anti-submarine warfare aircraft in January 2009. The P-8I is a custom-built variant of the P-8A Poseidon for the Indian military. The P-8I has been in production in December 2010. The delivery of the aircraft to the Indian Navy began in December 2012 and ended in October 2015. In March 2012, the first aircraft was handed to the U.S. Navy. As of 2019, the United States Navy was in possession of 98 P-8As with orders for 128 more. In March 2017, Norway placed an order for five P-8A Poseidon aircraft valued at around NKR 10 billion. The planes are planned to be delivered between 2022 and 2023. South Korea's Defense Acquisition Program Administration stated in June 2018 that it will purchase P-8 Poseidon Maritime Patrol aircraft for $1.8 billion under the Foreign Military Sales Program. Apart from these countries, P-8 Poseidon is also ordered by the United Kingdom and New Zealand, with the UK already taking delivery of 7 P-8 Poseidon as of October 2021. That's all for today, folks. We hope you found the video informative and fun to watch. Also, tell us in the comment section your views about the Boeing P-8 Poseidon. And if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon next to it for regular updates. Goodbye.